For the record, you're playing what's will been marked be, as, or will be marked as um, exhibit number five. You can stop it right there. <clears throat> All right, Ms. what are we looking at? Well, that's the day that we had saw Young Dolph and Pooley and Makita. All right, so whose car is that? It's Young Dolph's car. All right, and you say we, who, who saw this car? Me and Justin. Well, let's back up then and tell me how you know Justin. Oh, uh, do go band. All right, and who is go band? A nanny ain't go band quick. We know him by quick. Okay, who is quick? Uh, associate. All right, you say associate. Is he younger or older than you? Old. Uh, what neighborhood is he hanging out in? Orange Mound. Does he live over there? Yes, sir, he did. Do you know what street his house is on? Oh, uh, right. Uh, are you familiar with that street? Yes, sir. Uh, did you ever buy drugs from Mr. Govan? Yes, I bought ecstasy pills. Okay, would he sell you ecstasy pills? Yeah. Um, you ever heard the, the term like old head? Nah. Okay. Would you consider him sort of a older criminal figure in the neighborhood? Yeah, I call him like a bro, like a bro. Okay. Um, did you have another guy in that neighborhood you used to hang out with too? Yeah, Big Bobby. Big Bobby. And is that Bobby Carter? Bobby Carter, yes, sir. Uh, how often would you be over there on Bradley Street? I thought that's just about every day. Okay. So this was a hanging out area and you would buy ecstasy from Quit. Quit. All right. Uh, how is it that you met Justin through Quit? Oh, just. No, like, being around, basically, being around. Would Justin be around Quet too? Yeah, he'd be around Quet. Do you know why Justin would be around Quet? They, they look at each other like brothers, like, you know, brothers, okay. and, and then just a rapper or whatever. All right, you knew Justin to be a rapper? Yeah. Did you know his, his rap name? Straight Drop. And did you know Quet to be involved in, I guess, the rap business or something? He called himself. Okay. He called himself. What, what sort of would he call himself as far as being in the business? I guess a negotiator. I don't know. A negotiator? I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, do you know whether or not he was trying to negotiate for straight drop? I guess trying to get him a deal. Okay. Do you know who he was trying to get him a deal with? Oh, Big Jook and him. Got it him. All right. You said Big Jook, is that correct? Yeah. You ever heard of the music label CMG? Yeah. Is that Big Jokes? Yeah, Big Jokes. You know. And his brother, right? Yeah. His brother's Gotti, is that correct? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Before this day, which is in November of 2021, about how long had you been knowing Justin? Oh, a few months. A few months. About how many times do you think you'd been around him? Club 10, we went to club together. No, uh, we've been around each other a couple times. Okay. Uh, and for the record, I know that it's a formality, but for the record, can you point him out in the courtroom and tell me what he's wearing and stuff? Yeah, they got him brought over there with the, uh, the button down shirt, blue and white button down shirt. If the record could reflect that he's identified the defendant, Mr. Justin Johnson, Your Honor. Let the record reflect that the witness has identified the defendant in court. So how did you get to be with Justin Johnson this day on November 17th, 2021? Oh, uh, we, we knew that, you know, they had a hit on uh, Dolphin and head or whatever, so. Who had a hit on whose head? Big Jug had, had a hit on Dolph head or whatnot, so. How do you know that Big Jug had a hit on Dolph's head? Ah, because Quit had told me about it, Quit, and you know what I'm saying, being just. How much money was it supposed to be? 100000 on Dolph head. And had you agreed to do this hit? Yes, sir. Had Justin agreed to do this hit? Yes, sir. Are we all going to do it together? Yeah, they, they been on it, boy. Yeah. What was, was there any arrangements as far as splitting the money or anything? Yeah, uh, me and him and, uh, we, me and him supposed to be giving away 10000 a piece. All right, so you and him were going to give Govan 10000 a piece? Yeah. And how much were you going to get? I was getting 40, he was getting 40. Okay. Um, 
had you spoken with Justin about this? Yeah, we had, we had been talking about it. Okay. This was not something that just happened this day, but something that was in the process for weeks? How did y'all hook up this day, if you remember? He had pulled up to get me. He came and got me or whatever. Where did he get you from? He got me from my father's house. Where's your father's house? Up in Lamar Sims. Orange Mound area? Yeah. Had either you called him or he called you or anything like this? He had called me the first time I missed the call. Then he called me back. I answered him. He was telling me basically they were pulling up because we already knew what was going on. You already, when you say you already knew what was going on, you already knew what this is about? Yeah, because we knew they were doing a turkey drive, so we were actually on our way to West Woods. Had you and Justin talked about this particular day before? Like, nah, not the specific day. Like, we just knew that it was turkey drive on every day that we, we okay. just knew that. You knew that, is it fair to say that you knew Dolph was involved in these turkey drives this week before Thanksgiving? Yeah, we didn't know we were going to catch him, but we knew he did his artist. You know, everybody had a hit on him. Everybody had a price on him. From Jook? Yeah, from Jook. And that was going to be y'all's business this week? Yeah, that was that being you. When he had arrived at the house, do you remember what he was driving? Oh, white Mercedes beans. Okay, had you, had you seen that car before? No, I ain't never saw that car. Did you get in the car with him? Yeah, I got in. Was there anybody else in the car? No, it was just me and Jesse. Uh, were there any guns in the car? Yeah, they was on the big seat in the bag. Do you remember what kind of guns they were? A Draco handgun. Okay, and Draco, Memphis, some type of Bigger semi-automatic weapon, is that right? <coughs> and then a handgun? Do you remember what you were uh, wearing that day? I had on some gray suede pants, some orange and white uh, Jordan yeah, one, and a blue gap hoodie. A blue gap hoodie? With a do-rag on. With a do-rag on. Did y'all have, uh, did y'all have gloves? I had my own blue. You had, had your own, own gloves? gloves? Yeah, had my own blue. When you, when you got in the car, did you have your gloves on? No, I ain't have my gloves on. Uh, you said Justin had his own gloves? Yeah, he had his gloves on. Black gloves. He had his, his black gloves on before he picked you up? Yeah. Uh, does he get out of his car and pick you up, or do you go up to the car? Nah, I, no, I, got, I got out of the house, came out of the house, and got on in the car. Okay. Off to do the mission. Do, do try to catch somebody. Try to catch one of the rappers? Yeah, one of At the turkey drive in Westwood? In Westwood, yeah. All right. What happens if y'all get in the car? Oh, we went back on Bradley Street. He got some out of, uh, I think they were like a uh, expedition truck that he had parked on Bradley Street. And then we took the back street. And we was at Lamont Airways. We had the light. So he picks up, let me get this right. He picks you up in the Mercedes, is that right? Yeah. Uh, but you go to Bradley Street. Sure. Yeah. And is there an expedition already there? Yeah, expedition already there. Park in the Do you know who parked that expedition there? I guess he did. Okay, but we're not, we're not allowed to guess in here. Ah, well, okay. so nah, was, I didn't see him park it though. Okay. I don't see him. Uh, and what color was it? White. A white expedition. Yeah, white. All right. uh, did y'all do anything when y'all went to Bradley Street at that point? He got some at the truck. Then jump back in the car. I got you. So he gets out of the Mercedes of Bradley Street, goes into the expedition and gets something. Yeah. And comes back. Okay. Do you know what he got? Nah, I don't know. Uh, are y'all talking at this point? Nah, we we weren't talking. Like, cause he was on the phone at first, then he hung it up. But we weren't talking about. It. We weren't talking about. It. Okay. Now, y'all were cool with each other, is that right? You and Justin. Nah. He gets back in the white Mercedes? Yeah, he gets back in the white Mercedes. And we take the back street, then get you and stuff, to, uh, we was at Lamar and Airway. We finna get on the spreadway, going to the spreadway. Okay. Bradley to Dedrick, is that what you said? Yeah. And then y'all are gonna get on the expressway? Yeah, we finna get on the spreadway on Airways. Okay, but when, and this is Airways that we see. Yeah, it's Airways. 
Okay. Uh, what happens once y'all get to Airways? We hit the light. Y'all come clean across the light. How'd you know? How'd y'all know it was off? Everybody know, you know, how you call you, you know, the arm T pods and stuff. Yeah. People in Memphis knew about that wrap, right? Yeah. That camouflage white and green and blue wrap. That surprise you? See him like that? Yeah. Did you say anything or did Justin say anything? He was like, there goes dog right there. All right, what did y'all do? We received the trailer. We received right. the trailer. So y'all are following him on airways? Yeah, right over, right over the street. All right. And you saw the first part of this video, didn't you? Yeah. Did you see him pull off here to the cookie store? Yeah, he pulled in the cookie store. What'd y'all do? We made the block. We made the block. I came with the bag way. I came with the bag way. I jumped out. We started shooting. All right. Well, let's back up here, though. We saw him pull off of the airways <coughs> to here. Is that right? Yeah. Y'all, can you see my little pointer? Yeah. Y'all would be traveling this direction on airways. Is that right? right. Then did y'all do a crazy U-turn or anything, or what y'all nah, do? No, nah, no, nah. we came, we came with the big street. We okay. Came with the big street. Following the clickers, is this what y'all did? Yeah. Okay. We went to the light, made the loop around. Did you see him get out of his car like this? No, nah, I ain't seen him get out of the car. So y'all? Yeah, this is right there. Stop it here. It's me. Can you stop it? All right. We're gonna back up. I might want to, yeah, back up a little bit. All right. First guy out of the car, who's that? It's me. That's you? Which one of the guns do you have? I got the new Draco stab gun. Okay, that's that semi-automatic weapon, is that right? Yeah. You ever shot that thing before? No, I shot. You can proceed, Iris. Got your gap hoodie, is that right? You didn't. That's you, who are you shooting at? No, no. Alright, now back it up again, uh, Miss Iris, if you would. Back it up for Justin getting out of the car. All right, who's the second person here, the guy on the driver's side? It just... He's got the uh, smaller handgun, is that right? Yeah, the bad, bad, bad baseball hey, bad pro baseball You're firing this crazy thing. What you see, what are you feeling? I wouldn't feel nothing at the time. I ain't gonna even let it, huh? Trying to get some money. Bet you probably would have wasted on oxycodone and ecstasy. Trying to do you shot that gun a bunch? Right in there? Right then and there. Yeah, I can tell you how many times I shot out. Aiming for Dolph? Was he able to uh, say anything to y'all, or was he able to run or get away at all? I shot through the glass, so I wasn't close up on him. I was shooting through the glass. Okay. I saw him standing by the window. I just got out and started shooting. All right. Proceed until Justin shoots. There with the handgun. Who's that? It's Justin. All right. You proceed. All right, you stop right here. 
Saul's brother, Marcus. Did you know that he shot back at y'all? I ain't noticed until we pulled out. And there was a bullet hole in my side window. And oh, I told Jesse, I'm like, man, I'm hit. He was like, I'm hit too. So I see I'm hit right here on my leg. And I see a bullet hole in my sweater. I see, damn, I'm hit. So we driving out, he was saying he was hit. I'm talking to him, making sure we on Rick, making sure he's straight. I'm like, you all right? Like, yeah, I'm straight, I'm straight. But the bullet head went in my arm, and it was a bullet in my back. Let's, I want to back up. Uh, you and Justin here are running to the white Mercedes, is that right? Right. You get in what side of the car? I get on the passenger side. And Justin gets back in the driver's side? Yeah, he gets back in the driver's side. Y'all get in the car, and you can watch the rest of the, of the video here. Did y'all see Marcus getting a second gun from his car? No, nah, uh -huh. but when we pulled out and, and I knew it was shots back, I would finish you back, but there were too many cars coming and I didn't just want to hit no anybody, so I didn't shoot back. Because Marcus was shooting at y'all as y'all were leaving from down here, is that right? Yeah. Uh, and you would be in the car at this point? Yeah, we was in the car. Looking backwards? Yeah, I, I was looking back, but we, we had... Like how we were driving, like how he was driving, he was all the way on the other side, but you no, know, so I ain't want to just shoot back and hit him back So the shots, all the shots that you fired were the ones we saw right here uh, with Dolph, is that right? Yeah. Uh, and Justin too? Yeah. All right, so y'all didn't shoot back at Marcus as y'all were nah, driving? Nah, we didn't shoot back at him. 